Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and today we're gonna check out some of the best tools of 2019. So before we begin this video, quickly down in the comments, write which is your favorite tool, software or resource that you've been using in your design career and maybe share a link as well so that everybody can benefit from that. Now the first tool that I've uh, found is color review and uh, basically color review tells you a lot of things about the colors that you're about to choose so for example the project that i'm handling uh, has a brand color of green and i want to stick with that green so for example this uh, is the green now it'll first of all it'll show me what is the contrast between the text and the background uh, between green and white so as you can see, uh, it shows me that the contrast between foreground and background is 2.9, which is very little. So uh, the headlines and the text failed. So for example, I would have to change either the font color or I would have to change the green altogether. And as you can see, uh, it just shows me how the text would act. And if the background is darker, it'll show me that the text is great headlines are great and it has a high contrast so it'll help you uh, help you with the visual design process not only that it'll show you the text uh, in an actual paragraph with headings and illustrations and everything and you can even change the background if you like so if you want to see how green with uh, say a color like uh, purple light purple will look uh, it can it can show that to you um, in real time so it's a very useful tool now this next tool is actually by lift design and this is the lift app which is used to hail taxis in the US uh, so I was a little surprised to see this and uh, in this you can select the number of steps that your color palette should have you can uh, also add minor steps so even smaller steps like this and you can change the hue uh, from here of course the start hue and the end hue so for example I want uh, a, a rainbow color so I'll start from one end to the other and as you can see it shows me almost all the colors in the color spectrum and I can even choose what the curve will look like uh, which will define what kind of colors how how much difference there is between each one of these contrasting colors and it will and you can even change the contrast so if i want high levels of contrast i can uh, set it like this or if i want the colors to start from a low saturation of white and go up or i can uh, even uh, if i want to select all the black and white colors i can select them and this has so many options you can even select the amount of luminosity that your colors have uh, now this is something that uh, of course you uh, you would have to know color theory and how colors work in your design but this is a very good tool both for advanced as well as intermediate designers to set colors and discover new colors now this next incredible tool or uh, online software so as to say or an or an online resource so as to say comes from uh, icons 8 and icons 8 is a very popular developer for icons and these are animated icons you've heard of svg icons png icons now these are animated icons so basically this has a github link which takes you to the git official github page uh, of these guys and from there all you need to do is copy the code and put it inside your project so you get like a ton of uh, icons uh, you can quickly preview them here inside their website see how they look exactly and some of these are really neat and i totally approve of all of these animations they're quick they're uh, nothing more than micro interactions and they act very well as well so go ahead and check these out you can implement the, uh, through github and it's super easy to implement and start using on your website now the next design tool is called whimsical and uh, this is not just a simple design resource but an all-in-one ux design resource uh, which allows me to create flowcharts wireframes 
allows me to keep track with sticky notes and also create mind maps all on the same website you sign up once with google and you can start using all these services at once and as you can see it has a decent user base uh airbnb shopify netflix all of these guys use this as well once you sign up for free uh you get four free boards uh which is i think fine if you're working on uh, multiple projects and one uh once you want to start something you can just say okay i want a new wireframe i want to create a new wireframe it has all the wire necessary wireframing tools it allows you to quickly just drag and drop uh, certain elements that you want right here and you can then of course create your entire uh, wireframe or user interface right here and uh, also you can quickly shift from this to anything else from the panel right here and you can even start new sticky notes for example i want a new sticky note i'll stick one here and i can add whatever i like solve problems faster so uh, and you can just keep on adding these can act also act very like very good dream boards for you if or uh, just f uh, just for your imagination to go free so try out whimsical this is a personal recommendation of mine so this next cool uh, online tool is for free again and it's remove bg which uh, is short for remove background image so the aim of this is to select a photo and be able to remove the background from that photo so i'll just quickly pick up a, a picture that i saved for you guys to test this out uh, this will work best if the image is uh, the subject in the image is slightly separate from the background it's not blending in and as you can see it has already separated uh my ch uh, this little chair from the background almost perfectly you can even edit this further so you can add a separate background to this image how cool is that that's weird but that is also very very cool so just a one click tool for removing the background from any image okay so this next tool is a very crazy tool because this will really help web designers and developers to incorporate some 3d elements into their websites without having to you know create a lot of things on your own so for this of course uh, they have uh, two different pricings i will show you the free one which is for zero dollars of course once you're on the dashboard you can quickly create a new project and once i get into the new project it'll take a couple of seconds to load the environment and as you can see this is a 3d environment that i've loaded up and just to show you uh, quickly what it can basically do i'll create a quick uh, sphere uh, in this environment as you can see it's already put a sphere 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 and i can change the material as well so this is not just a very basic tool it you can, it, it can it allows you to change colors uh, material roughness so i can go from 20 i can make it really smooth to zero uh, so completely a smooth surface and i can as you can see i can rotate this it's not a hundred percent pixel perfect but it does work very well and for example i want to place this circle from the bottom right here i can go ahead and either export it which is of course a paid feature or i can use the free feature of embedding this so i can quickly say generate uh, it'll take a couple of seconds and a lot of your ram but um, after this is finished you can export it to your website so once this has rendered you just quickly copy the code from the bottom here and uh, you i'll just open a quick code pen uh, you know tab here and i'm just going to paste the html nothing else and let's see the preview right here uh, let it load for a um, quarter of a second and it should load up see how amazing this circle is and this just like four lines of code that's it and uh, as you can see i can rotate it all across as well now the circle is not perfect right now you can smoothen it up in back in uh, uh, vectory if you want uh, you can uh, reduce the roughness i've just given it a very rough surface like this like a rock uh, but this looks amazing and it's also interactive 
if you want to remove all these things of course you'll have to get the paid version but this looks very very cool okay so the next resource is called ux agenda and what does ux agenda do it allows you to see all the events in your area as well as all across the globe so whichever area you live in i'll just say delhi and as you can see there are no events in delhi if i search india it it shows me this bangalore uh, design up festival which is about to arrive and again it allows you to go to the conference page it allows you to buy tickets from here it allows you to see uh, all the information that is provided by the uh, producers or the organizers and of course if you want you can actually add your own event so uh, maybe if i hold an event ever i am going to post it here and tell you guys to reach Uh, this website so ux agenda if you're living anywhere in the world uh, be it india germany switzerland italy i don't know i hope you like that video i will be listing all the resources in the description comment down below whatever you liked and whatever you didn't and also subscribe to the channel click that bell icon and i'll see you every monday and thursday god bless